Geraldine and Peter McGinty's son Colin was on a night out with friends when he was stabbed in what detectives believed was a case of mistaken identity. Last year, his two killers went before the parole board to ask to be moved to an open prison. Geraldine and Peter spoke at those hearings about the impact of their son's murder. Not realising the couple could hear, the panel chairman, Judge Graham White, commented, I feel so very sorry for these families. They make these statements thinking they're going to make a difference, but they make no difference at all. Someone should tell them. In the row that followed, the couple were invited to submit a new impact statement as part of a review of the case. They were promised they'd be kept informed. Now they've learned the case has been reconsidered without their knowledge and their son's killers have been recommended for a move to an open prison. They have no consideration for our feelings whatsoever. They lead us along and it, it quite simply isn't good enough. I feel really let down by them. I feel all victims in general are let down by the judicial system because what they are quoting in their paperwork is not what they're actually doing. Their request for a meeting with the Justice Secretary has been turned down. The parole board is refusing to comment. June Kelly, BBC News.